Hello and welcome back to Railroads Online. So today we are here just kind of finishing up some run or some runs, whatever. I'm trying to get enough money up to uh, buy these oil tankers that we need. Did that go in there? Tell me that went in there. Yeah, it probably dropped in that back corner. That was kind of a pain to see. And so anyway, we're turning around and uh, running really the last of some boxcars here, or the boxcars for the tools. And we did get the August update yesterday, um, which really isn't an update. I mean, it's more of a news update, news bulletin, whatever you want, uh, want to call it. Definitely not a game update. Um, but they did turn around and put out a release that, you know, I don't know. It was kind of a hello, we're still here release, I guess, um, that said, you know, they released the contest winner from the contest that I think was back in, I don't remember, like December or something like that. It was quite a while ago, kind of even forgot about it, to be honest. I thought that was already done with. And then, um... They announced that there's a new member joining the team, so some kind of new partner, but that's about it, so pretty vague there. And um, they did announce that the official Discord is coming back. Um, you know, so who knows how that'll go. <laughs> so those were announcements that were kind of made. Other than that, like, I didn't really see much in there that was you know, all that noteworthy, to be honest, so not really worth all that separate of a video or anything. In my head, anyway, it was just kind of, you know, just an update of news, basically a, hey, here, we're still here, because we haven't really heard anything official for, you know, over a month, so I think that was kind of just their way of saying, you know, we're still here. Especially with the, you know, Century of Steam uh, trailer recently coming out. I think that that probably plays a part into where that came from. Which, you know, who knows? Well, as you just see how that goes coming out. At this point, it's a trailer. It isn't like it's a game. So, there isn't a lot there to talk about is my take on it when it's a game. You know, and I'm sure we'll take a look at it. Until then, it looks like it's an interesting trailer. That's my take on it. You know? But it seemed like that's what a lot of yesterday became about was the whole, you know, really Century of Steam versus Railroads Online, which, I mean, they're two different games, I guess, is my take. And at this point, you know, one's a game that's in development the other one is is still a concept until we actually see the game so there you go but that turned into a huge conversation i guess yesterday or at least it appeared to be But, so that's kind of the August update. I took it as, like, not really had an update for August, just a news update. But at least we did hear word from the team. So, there is that. And the new partner being brought online is certainly interesting because that could always speed along development. I, don't, I think that's always a good thing. Well, maybe not always a good thing, but definitely picking up the pace of Rero's development a little bit. I don't know that too many people would complain if that were to happen. Alright, so hit the brakes there. Yeah, it's kind of an August update without actually being an update, which is kind of interesting interesting way to release news I guess so I took it cool that's definitely gonna put us over enough so we are definitely gonna get some oil tankers so if nothing else call that one a win <laughs> so there you go you know August update talk about the um, news 
release uh, just to cover kind of my opinion on it like I said I didn't really think there was much in there so we'll just see how things go and what comes next and uh, I think we're going to call that one a win. Say thanks for tuning in. Remember, if you get a chance, like, share, subscribe. Subscriptions are free, but sure do help the channel. Y'all have a great day.